guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to do a little demonstration on how you guys can wash your shoes in the portable washer and spin dryer. So my boyfriend actually gave me the idea to do this because he wanted me to wash his shoes and he like asked, like, do you think it'll work? And I'm like, I don't really think it's going to work because how are you going to spin it? Like, you got to wring it out. How are you going to wring out the shoes? So I ended up trying it on his shoes first and they... Oh my gosh, this washer got his shoes so clean. They smell so good and they look like new, like new. So after I did his shoes, I did my shoes. And I was like, let me try my shoes because like I ain't washed my shoes in a minute. Why not? I want my shoes to smell good, smelling like his. They smell like fresh laundry. So I am going to show you guys um, how to wash my shoes. And I actually washed one pair of my Nikes already and I have my other pair right now that I wanna wash. And I wanted to show you guys that you can also wash shoes in the portable washer, it's been dry. That's so crazy, like you can wash a lot of stuff. So I did wanna point out like my shoes, so I wear an eight and a half and my boyfriend wears a 10 and a half and it fit both of our shoes however because my feet is smaller i was able to fit two of my shoes in the washer but like one pair two shoes one pair but he could only fit one so i think if your feet is bigger than like maybe like eight eight and a half or in guy if you're a guy and your feet is probably bigger than like a seven a six you might only be able to fit one pit one shoe in at a time but it can wash shoes and it's like kind of cool so i got the water going it actually yeah you know, i'm not gonna lie i put way too much soap in it i forgot i'm not washing clothes i'm washing shoes so here are my shoes my nikes and i've had these for a while um i wear them to work periodically i switch out different my different shoes that i wear to work so here's one pair um and yeah y'all i'm just gonna put it in there <laughs> so depending on how heavy the shoe is the type of brand of shoe it, it you might only be able to fit one in here at a time however i was able to fit two of the other ones so hopefully i can fit two of this time i haven't washed these ones yet so we'll see together <laughs> but um it will knock a little bit because they're shoes so it does knock a little bit but um it's not to a point where it should disturb like any neighbors or anything so that actually looks like it's spinning kind of good so I know some of you guys some of you guys are probably like yeah that worked so I'm eight and a half like I said and both shoes fit in here and they're spinning fine they're not stuck or anything like that sometimes they will get stuck at a certain angle so you might have to adjust it every now and again um, with the shoes but um, it looks like it's doing okay um, also I know you guys are gonna ask like about how do you dry it um, I will put the I will actually show you guys how to dry these after these are done, but they fit in the spinner ironically, so um, Yeah, make sure if you do decide to wash your shoes that you put it in the spinner first Just to make sure the spinner can close because the spinner actually does wring the shoes out like really really good And it doesn't damage it in any way, so I am going to let these wash and I'll be right back All right, so these are all done. I'm going to dry them in the spin dryer so I could have drained the water already um it doesn't really matter technically I did put way too much soap in here you guys <laughs> way too much but at least they're gonna be smelling really good um and the soap that I use I use the gain and I also use the scent boosters as well with these um and I want to mention that because this isn't like a full low a full load of laundry you don't need like fabric softener or anything like that um, after you wash them. You can put your regular detergent in it like normal, but then um, you just wring them out. I don't really think you need to rinse them. Um, I didn't rinse them last time and they still turned out fine. Um, so um, as you can see, I'm trying to place it in here. Now look, it looks like my shoe is like way too big to be in here, but I'm not gonna lie, all you gotta do is just that. <laughs> so if you have like, to me, I've had these Nikes for forever, so I don't care about bending them like that. If you have, like, super, super expensive shoes and you don't want to do that, then you might not want to wash them in here. But more more than likely, you can bend your shoe just a little bit. So I'm trying to get this off, but I'm, like, making it worse. So up here is, like, fabric, so it doesn't hurt to bend it right there. It's actually a running shoe, so it's meant to bend. So all I do is put it like that, and since... Normally you would use the cover to place it on here. You're not going to use that because it's not going to fit. Um, and then you just turn it on. 
then you gotta hold it <laughs> and I don't have the drain on just yet probably should put this down so it is loud um, it's definitely louder than doing a load of laundry but it's getting the job done and you only got to use it for like a couple seconds all right look at that <laughs> the whole shoe is like clean it's literally clean like it got it all off and it's oh my god this shoe looks so good and it smells good y'all <laughs> this smells so good so i'm gonna do that with the next one i put way too much soap in here i honestly feel like i could wash clothes with this as much soap as i put it in here but i don't want to put my clothes with my shoes that's kind of gross i'm a germaphobe so i think about those kind of things okay so let's do the next one. Let's make sure this is up and right. And then hold it immediately. As soon as it starts spinning, just hold it because it's heavier to shoe. So my hands are so soapy. <laughs> I put way too much soap, guys. Don't get me in the comments. All right. That should be good enough. and here's my other shoe two clean shoes so i'm going to come over here and oh i gotta put the middle bar back in <laughs> okay so i put the middle bar back in and the way that i dried them was by putting it on the edge like right there so it's on this bar and the middle bar um doing that it stays <laughs> so it Unless you guys live in like a warmer climate, you can obviously put your shoes outside to dry. Um, if you don't like that and you have one of these things like I have, the portable dryer, um, you can put it in here like this if you don't want bugs in your shoes or if you're like worried about anything like that. Um, and you guys, literally in a few hours, these will be dry. So I am going to dry these. <laughs> Zip this up. Mini update on the dryer, you guys. I just turned it on. I haven't used it for like a few days. And it's not loud anymore. It actually is doing its job and I've been using it for like the last few weeks. So it's fine. And I just try to make sure I don't drop any more hangers on the dryer because that's why I stopped before. But I'm gonna let this go and then these are gonna be dry, you guys. And that's basically it. That's basically all you do. So that is basically how you can wash your shoes with a portable washer and spin dryer. Um, you don't have to do it like that, obviously, if you don't want to. You guys can come up with your own way of washing clothes. My way is just what I, how I do it. Um, but you guys can obviously have, will have your own way to do it. So that is basically it for this video. I'm trying to think, did I miss anything? No. But if you guys have any other questions or anything like that, um, write them in the comments below. I'm always responding to people and I need to get like a towel. My hand is like still soapy. But let me know in the comments if you guys have any other questions about the washer or anything else you guys want to see. I'm actually going to do a video about, um, I'm going to try and see if I can wash my winter coat. I'm going to actually test that and if I can, then I will do a video of me washing my winter coat and winter clothes. Because I know a lot of people had questions about just like what all can you really wash with this thing. So not only can you guys wash laundry, but you guys just seen you can wash shoes. And um, now I'm going to try and see if my winter stuff will fit. So if it does fit, be looking out for another video. Um, if not, then um, there's your answer. <laughs> So that is going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this was helpful and that you guys um, can understand that this washer can really wash so much stuff, like so much stuff. Make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you guys subscribe to my channel and hit that bell notification button to be notified every time I upload a video. And I will see you in my next one. Bye. So you guys, it's been about an hour and I actually forgot to mention that you do want to flip your shoes upside down <laughs> like every couple of hours um, if you have it in this dryer just so you know the inside is going to get dry too so I did want to mention that I didn't want people being like what about the inside of the shoe you didn't show that <laughs> so just flip it upside down and put it on the rack just like that and it stays it doesn't go anywhere <laughs> 
All right, you guys.